Be warned, this video might contain some things you don't want, like gambling, drinking, and some profanity language. On deck seven, we have here yeah, the casino. So let's check it out today. And we can see here yeah, the map. Basically, the casino is quite a big chunk of it. Yesterday happened a funny story out of the casino, but casinos do have some rules for filming which basically means not filming. So I can only film now because it is closed, there is nobody, and uh, I'm not violating any person's privacy, privacy to gamble. Also, not to encourage people gambling. <laughs> I also have another problem, which is the background music. I hope that you don't get the, a lot of it so that it doesn't get into some kind of copyright violation <laughs> with the music. Anyway, yeah, we have, but it was so funny. I'm super rich. I just learned that I win uh, $6. <laughs> So I went there to the cashier, I put 50 bucks onto the card and I decided to start playing. Well, one of the little things I know more or less is like poker. So I decided to go to one of these machines that has the poker. And because to be honest, these are the jackpot machines. I'm clueless, clueless what they do and how they work. You know, it's just press buttons and do whatever. So there I was playing this uh, poker machine. I have just discovered um, that I can play poker. This is a poker machine. Oh. Yeah. And I'm going to do some stupid stuff. I don't know. I'm going to bet like uh, $2. And basically I was like, you know, bet $1 and then gain $2. Bet $1, lose $1. Bet $1, gain $2 or $3, you know, all very little quantities of stuff. And now I just got two pairs, two pairs. But it ended up being fun. Now, I ended up playing like for what, two hours roughly? And during those two hours, you know, you were ordering drinks and getting more drinks and more drinks and more drinks. <laughs> I think I was completely... Well, you know what I mean. I'm not encouraging anybody to drink. Please don't, don't, don't. It's a bit of ugly and I didn't feel like I was in control of my full actions. Anyway, it was fun. I was enjoying myself. And I just kept on playing. And then I decided that after like two hours, it started to get boring, you know, always like pressing the buttons, pressing the buttons and nothing else. And basically, <laughs> at that moment in time, I went to cash out. So out of the 50 bucks I put in, I betted, I betted, is, no, I bet, I betted, I, I betteration, I betteration, okay, doesn't matter. I bet $50, $5, cash out 49. So I was here two hours playing for one buck. Oh, that is much better than driving the go-karts. Yeah, tomorrow I'll drive the go-karts for you. Yeah, okay, good, let's go. So out of the 50 bucks I put in, I cashed out 49 bucks. So spent two hours <laughs> playing, having fun, drinking from the package and spent only one dollar. Nice, isn't it? Well, and the casino has got a lot of uh, these uh, areas. It is quite a big one. I do like this atrium. Uh, it has this place here. The casino has this place here, which looks uh, cool, but it looks to be like for the eye rollers. I've got no clue on how much they uh, cost or do need to have a bet. Three of one kind. I don't know, but I must be an expert in this bloody game. I think I'll bet a million dollars. What do you think? And then you've got a lot of uh, tables, uh, the typical blackjacks and pokers and what, what not. So I do see the appeal. A lot of people have fun. A lot of people pay cruises by gambling or losing money. And the cruise company says, oh, you lost so many, much money. I, am, I have so much pity of you. Let me offer you another cruise. <laughs> now my math brain is not working. I'm not sure if it is the Moscow mule or if it is the stupid combination I got. 
Well, it is what it is. So it's a simple story. Not much. I've never done uh, gambling in my life. Um, and I don't think I will ever do. It didn't excite me. It was fun for a while, but you're always uh, on the probability of losing a ton of money. And that can be very difficult for you. Anyway, because my, my background is in maths and IT, I know all these machines. Let's be honest about it. They are completely rigged for you to lose money. It might not be for you to lose a ton of money, but definitely with the odds of like 5% will go to the house or probably even more than 5%. I have zero clue about it. What I can tell you is <laughs> just try to have fun, enjoy and be careful and be responsible and don't do crazy stuff. But the installations it has are good. There are bars, the cashiers, the whatever. And also it is one of the places I find curious is if you need to smoke somewhere around, you've got here this uh, room for smokers in the casino and some people just come just to smoke not even to play just because they don't have other space to do it so cool have fun i hope you enjoyed yet another weird video about specifically on the casino of the norwegian joy do subscribe and enjoy and follow more episodes